BBC iPlayer allows you to watch most television and radio programmes broadcast on the BBC during the last seven days. It has become an essential part of our TV watching and radio listening habits. However, the lack of official flash support on the new Android Jelly Bean operating system has meant that iPlayer doesn't work through browsers until now. A BBC media player makes iPlayer programmes work even if you don't have flash. If you open up the application itself, it's not going to do much except send you to the iPlayer website in a browser. Currently, my Asus Transformer Prime doesn't have flash, so watch what happens when I press on a program. Firstly, it doesn't say I need flash to play this program, and secondly, when I press play, the BBC Media Player app kicks in and plays the video. You may have noticed that this is not playing in HD, so the quality is mediocre at best. So this is the new way of using iPlayer, but there is an old method that's a little more tricky to do, but does have some nice benefits. Direct yourself to this webpage on the XDA forums, the address is included in the description, where you can download Flash and an older version of iPlayer for Android. You will need to sideload both of these apps onto your Nexus, so see the video description on how to do this. Once you have done this, you will have a dedicated iPlayer application that has a much nicer navigation system than using the iPlayer website itself. What this application is doing is using Flash rather than the new BBC Media Player app, so obviously there is no need to download it. Simply press on a program and it will load and play. Life with the Doctor was like this. Yeah, I'm trying to. So the choice is yours, use the new media player or get Flash and the older iPlayer app. My preference is the latter because my attitude is that a dedicated app is always better than a web browser because the navigation system is designed for touchscreen devices. The only problem is you won't be able to upgrade this version of iPlayer whereas the new BBC media player will be updated in the future. Also, installing BBC media player and the old iPlayer app may cause a little bit of confusion as when I did it, it just seemed to revert back to iPlayer all the time. As for using iPlayer outside of the United Kingdom, well I'm afraid I don't know the answer to that, but if anyone would like me to test this, I don't mind an all expenses paid trip to the Bahamas.